In this tutorial, we will show you how to set up Apogee Quartet in Logic Pro 10 and begin recording quickly. To follow this tutorial, you will need to have Mac OS 10.8.4 or greater in Logic Pro 10. Open Logic and create a new session. Click on Preferences, Audio, choose Quartet for your output and input device. For now, set the buffer to 64. For best latency performance, you can set it to 32. However, you may need to set the buffer higher depending on the size of the project you are working on. Make sure that software monitoring is selected. Click on Apply Changes and close the Preferences window. Open Maestro 2 found in the Applications folder. Click on the Input tab. Here you can select from the different quartet input choices. Plus 4 and minus 10 bypass quartet's mic preamps and give you a direct line level connection to the A to D converter. Mic is for connecting a dynamic, ribbon, or condenser mic to Quartet. If you are connecting a condenser mic, you will also click on the 48 button to turn Phantom Power on. Instrument is for connecting a guitar, bass, or keyboard to the quarter inch instrument inputs. Now click on Output Routing. In the Output Routing section, you can select how you want to route Quartet's eight outputs. The headphones default to outputs one and two. If you would like to assign the headphones to any other outputs, Simply select here. This is useful when sending a different mix to the performer. After connecting your headphones or monitors to Quartet, select the input you wish to use. Click on Logic's Record Enable button. Adjust your input level with Quartet or in the Maestro software. You will now hear the input source you have plugged in. You are now ready to record.